the position of the Philippines is very clear. There are still a lot of questions. This is a developing story, but we would like to end the press conference with a few words from Director General. The Filipino people and the whole world know and has seen that the, ins the incidents of the past two days um, is a serious escalation uh, on the part of the People's Republic of China. The Department of Foreign Affairs has also lodged a protest to the maritime communication mechanism yesterday while the Aurora mission was underway. The Chinese ambassador has also been summoned. Once again, we thank the international community for their continued expression of support to the Philippines and the defense of the rules-based international order. We will continue to call on China to be a responsible member of the international community and abide by its commitments deceased from undertaking actions that violate Philippine sovereignty, sovereign rights, and jurisdiction in the West Philippine Sea, and undermine the mutual trust and confidence that should underpin bilateral relations. Call on the Chinese government to stop these aggressive activities and refrain from intimidating and harassing our Philippine officer folk who are just lawfully and peacefully fishing in Bajo de Masinlok, knowing that it is part of our national territory.